morning guys. I haven't filmed anything in a few days. Sorry for that, but it's the morning. I ran out of breakfast food, so I went and got a couple bagels. I don't have anything to do today until about like 12.30 and it's 8 in the morning. And I can't really go back to bed because I got 10 hours of sleep. But for some reason, I'm super tired. On the plus side, I went outside to get into my car and there were lots of orange and red leaves that have fallen on my car and it's very cold so I'm super nostalgic and super excited about fall today so much so that I am lighting a candle at 8 in the morning I don't think I've ever shown you guys the basement. It's where our washer and dryer are, which took us way too long to get, but this looks like something out of a scary movie. And for some reason, we have to pay to use our washer and dryers. The washer's 150, this is a dollar. I don't like being down here. I'm gonna go back upstairs. <laughs> I didn't even know we had this until a couple weeks ago. Well, guys, it is now 11 p.m. I'm kind of paranoid because I just watched A Haunting in Connecticut 2 and my official review of it is that I was not impressed. I give it a 2 out of 10. Lots of plot holes, lots of stuff that annoyed me. Just didn't really like the movie. Recap of today. Brought my cameras to the pool to film stuff. Didn't film anything. Was too into the workout. Was super busy. And then after that, brought my cameras with me. Just was too busy hanging out with people and talking with people to pull out a camera. So that's my bad. But to make up for it, you guys, for some reason, I don't know why. Maybe I asked you guys. I can't remember. But I went through my Tumblr and there are a ton of questions that say give your top five of different categories. So I'm gonna go through that and kind of give my general top five. Okay, uh, first things first, top five items in your room. Number one, this computer mouse. Makes my workflow so much easier. Number two, my cell phone. Number three, this camera. Number four, my computer setup. And number five is my backup computer, or my travel computer. Top five compliments you've received. Um, I honestly have no idea. <laughs> Top five cars. Um, okay, so we'll start with number five is a Dodge Charger. It's my realistic dream car. Number four would be that Lamborghini that was voted the ugliest car of 2010. I think it looks cool. Uh, number three would have to be any type of of, uh, what's it called, what's it called? Oh yeah, any type of Ferrari. Number two, Tesla. Number one, Aston Martin. Top five Christmas songs. If you do not follow me on Twitter, you will not have seen my Spotify playlist I recently uploaded to Twitter that is just full of Christmas music. And it's a playlist of I think like 80 something songs. Oh, I already have it open because I was listening to it last. Um, but it's a playlist full of my favorite Christmas songs and I'll give you my top five right now. Number five, That's Christmas To Me by Pentatonix. Just came out last year and it, it honestly reminds me so much of last year's Christmas season. And it's such a Christmassy song and it, it gets me in the spirit. Number two, Mary Did You Know by pretty much any artist. Number two, number, number three, the, it was the five, then four, now we're on three. Number three is All I Want For Christmas Is You by Michael Buble. I don't like the Mariah Carey version. I like Michael Buble's version a lot better. Um, number two would definitely have to be It's Beginning To Look A Lot Like Christmas by Nat King Cole or Frank Sinatra or Michael Buble. And number one is Oh Holy Night by Glee with Leah Michelle. <sighs> it's just flawless. Um, and then the last question is top five celebrity disappointments. I'm actually gonna let you guys answer that one down in the comments. Anyway guys, I know like I'm sorry for saying hi in the morning and then saying hi in almost tomorrow's morning because we're an hour away from October 14th. Um, so that's my bad. 
Thank you for watching. Sorry I didn't film the past couple days. I need to stop saying sorry so much because you guys always tell me to stop saying sorry in the comments. So sorry about that. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to go to sleep. I will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. If you're new, be sure to hit subscribe. We're getting close to 8,600 subscribers. Maybe within the next month or two. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.